sewers filled with trash may not be the most likely place for a laboratory setup, but Brazilian researchers at the State University of Rio de Janeiro are tracking the spread of coronavirus in the neighborhood of Santa Marta through an unlikely source, the sewage water. Wastewater can contain traces of the virus if community members are infected, and researchers are also testing the air around the sewers to determine if the sewage water spray contains traces as well. Researcher Etor Evangelista explains. We set up equipment here with devices to detect the virus. The equipment is set up in this environment with people passing by, and the objective is to measure the accumulated viral load over the course of a day. The Santa Marta favela, like many Brazilian low-income neighborhoods, suffers from poor infrastructure. Rio's favelas are home to some 1.3 million people, where COVID-19 cases are difficult to count. Infection rates in the slums are feared to be higher than reported due to poor nutrition, cramped housing, and ill health. Tiago Firmino invited the researchers to help track the spread of the virus in Santa Marta. We carried out a deep cleaning project and we invited them to do a research project to measure the quality of the environment in areas with open sewers and air quality in the streets of the favela. Brazil is grappling with the world's second largest coronavirus outbreak, with over 2.4 million cases and over 87,000 deaths as of Monday. Brazilian President Jair Bolsonaro has come under fire for downplaying the outbreak's severity. A criminal complaint was filed against him after he took his mask off in the presence of reporters, just as he announced he had tested positive for the virus himself earlier this month. But on Monday, he unmasked yet again at the urging of his supporters. He announced he had finally tested negative just days earlier.